Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And the match begins. Eber Bessa. A wilting under the pressure. And now they try to go forward. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And there to intervene. Oh, that's a really good run. Could be. And a goal. An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Jason Cummings. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Pressing high, and they have the ball again. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. And this for 1-1. One, one. Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Eber Bessa. Giving the ball away. Opportunity. Can he put it away? 
Well, not every player is capable of that sort of thing. Full marks for trying. Shame about the execution. Jefferson did well to win the ball back. Chance to do damage. He has time to play it over. A smart stop here. Corner kick played in and able to get a body in the way. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. Chance to equalise here. And a timely penalty save. And unable to keep possession. Options in the centre. Veering in field here. And not testing the keeper at all with that effort. Eber Bessa. Can they hit on the break? All in all, a broken counter attack. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Well, the chance looked to be on, but found himself offside. Strong but fair tackle. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Oh, that's a fine save. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. He's going forward well here. And there it is, the half-time whistle. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, the counter chance looks very real. All hands on deck. Well, it fizzled out. Jefferson. Now, oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Well, the referee deciding that it didn't warrant a yellow card being handed out.
Well, far from the ideal pass. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Farrell. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. Well, the stats tell you everything. At times, they've controlled possession. They've created some good opportunities going forward. There's been some good attack in play. But when they've had the chances, they've been really poor in front of goal. It's just not been good enough. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Could be a chance to break here. And he's in. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. And players waiting in the centre. And very deftly cut out. And he's lost custody of the ball here. And the cross into the middle. And able to get a body in the way. And the referee says penalty. And this for 1-1. One, one. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. One, one. Eber Bessa. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Just ten minutes remaining here. And a goal at this stage could be decisive. Good pressure, can they make something of this? Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Jefferson. Surely. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal.
So back underway at 2 1. Tight contest here. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. Yes, Derek. Well, it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It was so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing, and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, he's the match winner, and deservedly so. He was outstanding today. He's great to watch when he's in this sort of form.